Hello and welcome back to Bo's Garage. And I know you're probably sitting on sitting on the couch or on your bed or in an airport going, Corey, I don't want to see any more bullshit with the Mustang. Well, I'm aware. I'm well aware. There she is. But we're not going that way, are we? No, no. This beautiful beast decided to work its way back into my life. Yes. The 1979 Dodge... Power wagon has returned. And boy, what a triumphant return it is. I know it's kind of a gloomy day, but once again, I know all of you can appreciate an old vintage vehicle and in all of its glory. This is uh, one, this is a few, this is hours, before, uh, I don't know the exact amount of hours, but it's a certain amount of hours before the Star Rock Nationals crew, car cruise night, which leads into the Star Rock Nationals car show. That new Dodge ain't got nothing on on this thing. So I'm a, the Mustang's the cleanest of the vehicles that I have. It's nice, but it's not loud. This thing's vintage, and you are it's obnoxiously loud. <laughs> I don't have to. I don't have to. Uh, I don't have to tell you any specifics on that one. But starting it on the back, you know, we've got. I know you've all seen it before. You've probably heard me say it a million times. It ain't a beast. It ain't. A, it, it's a beast, but it ain't a beauty, or vice versa. Well, you've got your rusted out tail, your rusted bumper, your your dented tailgate, your extra parts with a now clean out cleaned out bed. No, there isn't. There is no holes in here. But as you can tell. This Dodge has seen a thing or two because it knows a thing or two. I'll probably make another video here soon just to just to detail everything. But for now, I'm going to set you on the top of the hood for just a second. Actually, you know what? I'll set you over here so you kind of get, get a bird's eye view there. Hoist. Grab and lift. Yes. So to go through it again, we've got our 1979 Dodge Power Wagon powered by a 350. Forget, I think this is a 5.9. I don't know. Correct me if I'm wrong. All of the things in here are still as they should be. Wait, what? Engine 318. Huh. Then why was I saying 360? Okay, maybe this has some details. Holy cow! I have no idea. Some of these papers in here, didn't you? They have seen some better days. But but if you. In here, you can see all the firing order and whatnot. Alternator still works. The radiator has seen many, many better days. But, as you can tell, she still runs and lives. So I'll make another one of these, just hopefully detailing it. Maybe I'll drive it through town with all the other cruisers. Don't quote me on that. I don't know for sure. <laughs> but... Stay tuned, see what this old Dodge has to bring. <laughs> 